Hello everybody, my name is Mr. C. Ferrante, and today I'll be taking a look at Level 6, also known as the Hotel. Level Classification Difficulty 4 out of 5 Affects sanity greatly and has unstable boilers. Entity Count 0 out of 5 Not applicable. Chaos Gradient 1 out of 5 Non-linear in some areas. The Bassett Fraser Index 4.5 out of 5 this level is impossible to live in due to sanity affecting properties. Description Level 6 is a finite hotel decorated in the oriental style. Wanderers will no clip in alone, even if multiple people are in the level at the same time. Everyone will be alone in the hotel. Despite being deserted, the hotel follows the routine as if open. Meals will appear in the dining area in the morning, noon, and evening. Music will play in the ballroom, and beds will remake themselves. The music of which causes memory loss after extended periods of time. Despite being completely devoid of entities, multiple objects such as paintings, vases, and stained glass in this level depict an image of a Cthulhu-like being. When not being looked at, the objects change to show the beast closer to your location. When in the same room that the objects depict the beast being in, Despite the absence of such an entity, you will experience a strong sensation of being watched and a powerful urge to run away. The beast is most commonly depicted in areas around the boiler room, apparently guarding the exit. Level 6 has strong effects on sanity, driving wanderers insane through isolation and terror. Level 6 does not allow objects to function as they normally would. It tends to slightly alter the use of the object. Some objects are rendered completely unusable, such as modern technology. Almond water causes hallucinations and temporary paranoia. For these reasons, it is recommended to get through level 6 without objects. The Lobby this area is the tamer of the two. It causes mild sanity problems and rarely causes death. The majority of the rooms in level 6 are in this area. These rooms are mostly empty hotel rooms with mild decor and furnishing. Strange objects can be found in the closets of these rooms, typically ranging from the 1920s to the 40s. The Cthulhu-like being is not seen very commonly here and does not create as much urgency. Two elevators are here, although, despite these elevators looking functional, the doors are melted together. Other rooms in this area are special rooms. These rooms are known as the Diner and the Ballroom. The Diner this is a large room near what appears to be the entrance. It has 12 basic tables laid out. A salad bar and a dessert table are placed in the corner of the room. Despite having no living beings, this room regularly updates its food. This means that the food never rots and food on the tables appear at every meal of the day. The Ballroom the ballroom is a large room at the end of the hallway. This room contains about two dozen headless mannequins. When they are not being looked at, they cause a sense of being watched. This ballroom also has a constant noise of 1940s ballroom music. Staying in this room for an extended period of time can cause mental deterioration and permanent memory loss. The Boiler Room the boiler room is the area outside the hotel of level 6 and extends infinitely in all directions, being filled with pipes, vents, and of course, boilers. An infinite number of other hotels exist in the boiler room, some housing other people trapped in level 6. 
The majority of the space in the boiler room is cramped passages between hotels with low-hanging pipes running overhead. The floor of the boiler room is iron grating which allows a constant dripping of water to fall through from the above floors and steam leaks to rise up from the pipes below, and the only light is from the fire in the boilers. The steam leaks create a high risk of injury, so staying in the boiler room for an extended period of time is not recommended. Communities Due to the difficulty and nature of this level, permanent civilizations are unfeasible and impossible to sustain for lengthy periods of time. Entrances and Exits Entrances Level 6 can be entered by going through ornate doors in level 5. Any of this level's sublevels are also entrances. Exits. The only exits from level 6 are shadows in the boiler room. By going through these shadows, you will end up in level 7. Other exits include level 6's sublevels.